Oh! Love the graphics. <sighs> I wish I could go outside and play, but it's been raining all day. And there's nothing to do inside here. I finished all of the levels on the official Pajama Man console game, <laughs> and the Pajama Man animated series is already in reruns. Hey, maybe I could play some board games! Yeah. Just might work. What do we got here, Pajama Sam? This looks like a job for the amazing game playing powers of. Hang on a second. Pajama Sam. Now where are those? There's no music. Whoa! We'll see about that. Oh wow, that's a lot more games than I thought there were. Was quite a ball. Thank goodness I was wearing my cape. Wow! Look at all of these fun board games to choose from. I don't own any of these. I was thinking we were gonna have like Dominion or like even Monopoly, but huh? Four cheese pizza. We gotta try it. Choose your game options for four cheese pizza. Well, I've literally never played this before, so we're gonna do easy first. Oh well, no, we can at least start on medium. Actually, no, maybe easy will explain the rules. Goody gumdrops! Another delicious slice of four cheese pizza! Here's what you do. You and your opponent move around the board trying to collect all four color triangles of cheese. The first one to collect all four colors of cheese wins. You go first. Okay. All right. Oh, it's like on-ramps and off-ramps from the Puppet and Fatty Bear activity pack. Blue. Cool. Well, I'm going to go the farthest, right? Um. Oh, green. I'm sorry. Why did I think it was went on uh, blue? All right, Sam, where are you going? <laughs> it's, it, it's Trivial Pursuit without the trivia. Sam it just went from, like, a 0 to an 11 when it came to, like, how enthusiastic he was about playing board games. Uh, apparently, I apparently I made him go back home? If he land on the same spot? Oh, it's like, sorry! Never mind, okay, so this seems like it's like, sorry, maybe. All right, I can I can dig this. So this must have been made after Pajama Sam three. Let's head over to the yellow cheese. Okay, so you can always choose your pathway at the junction. That's interesting. This seems like a fairly luck based game though. So like, <laughs> my purple piece is like, oh, I wanted that. <laughs> this is uh, this is an un this is an interesting game. Green. Oh, you have to land on... Okay, so it is like Trivial Pursuit, but without the trivia. Oh, that's, that actually is kind of stupid. <laughs> so it's just a, a game of chance, then. Oh, yeah, the yellow cheese! You got a yellow <laughs> I do like how the spinner is a pizza cutter. Yeah, that's that's a that's a fun little touch. Okay, is that just the whole game then? Okay, yeah, that's literally just the whole game. Would you like to leave four cheese pizza? Yeah, yeah, I think I would. Not that that's not great. Okay, um, goody goody gumdrops. They look so happy. Oh, they're using the Pajama Sam 3 music. Alright, let's go hard. Oh boy. Yes! Goody, goody gumdrops. Listen up, because here's how you play. Is this you just reversing? As many of your opponent's pieces as possible. When you've trapped a piece, it changes to your color. It's reversing. Alright. I could never beat Fatty Bear at Reversi, so we'll see how this goes. Oh, wait. No, it's different from Reversi. Now it's your turn to trap a piece. I don't think you can. 
Yeah, maybe it's a fellow. Okay. You in trouble now, Carrot? Your turn. Okay. Oh wait, that's a bit that was a mistake. Ugh. He got me good. Oh, alright. Alright, Mr. Carrot. Yeah, he's he's good. Do I have a favorite pizza topping? Uh, pepperoni, definitely. You have to trap. Ah, curse you, carrot! I don't think you can move. There we go. That'll do it. How is that guy not flipped? <laughs> hey! That's a bad move. <laughs> That's a bad move. Alright, I'll move there then. Um. Right on. Yikes. <laughs> hey! <laughs> yes, it's, it's fascinating. Very exciting. Yes, these are mine now. Yeah, what? How did he do that? Your turn. Man, I didn't see that move coming. He's like, man, that move sucked. Hey. Uh, hey. Yikes. Just the, yeah, this literally is like playing Fatty Bear in reversey. I just get my butt kicked. I did play on hard, to be fair, but... Um, that'll flip one. This'll flip one as well. But if I do that, then... Wow, all the squares are taken. And he wins. Let's tally up the gumdrops. I mean, I can tell. You win. <laughs> He's like, no, I want to see how much I won by. <laughs> yeah. I just cannot grasp perversity. Good job, Carrot. I won. Hey, you can always try again some other time. How about another game? <laughs> no. I'll catch you on the flip side. All right, thanks, Carrot. Uh, what is next? Rock pile. That sounds good. I assume cheese and crackers is exactly the same as it is in. Uh, the main, uh, no need to hide when it's dark outside. Alright, what do we got here? Hi, Carrot. Hey, how's it going? I'm Carrot. Yeah, I know. So, you want to play a rock pile, huh? Well, the object is to collect all of the rocks in the small bowls and put them into the large bowls at either end of the board. The first player with the most rocks in their large bowl da -da 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 -da, wins. Let's go. You go ahead. Is there, like, any strategy here? My turn. Your turn. Again, is there any strategy here? Get another turn. I do? Can I just keep... Wait. Um... Either I'm missing some critical rules, or this... Oh! I see how it goes. Okay. Now I get ya. Okay, okay, okay. Hmm. 
Okay. This makes more sense now. Your turn. Okay, and like if I pick this guy up, it would only move him over one. All right, all right. And I can only move rocks that are on my colors. Okay, this is this is interesting. I'm also going to assume that if I have no valid... Oh, wait, I should have just moved that one guy. Okay, I made, I made an oopsie. I should have moved the one rock over before doing that previous move. Oh, he didn't dump any of his on my area. It's a little interesting. Okay. It's Carrot's turn! Yeah, so he's dumping a lot of rocks on my side now. Yeah, okay, so he didn't dump any on my side. <laughs> yeah, you gotta think before you act. Or in my case, just keep dumping you the rocks get over another here. Turn. Why? Because I got one on my side without putting any on yours? If this is the hardest difficulty, this doesn't seem that difficult. I get to take those rocks. Why? You didn't explain the rule as to why you were allowed to do that. Because I would very much... If the last one is in your scoring space, you get another turn. Oh, that's how it works. Can somebody enlighten me as to why he was allowed to take all of those? Since this seems to be an actual game, just pajama samified. So I get another turn now, right? No, I don't get another turn. Now I'm very confused. My turn again. I love how he didn't explain these rules at all. Is this just because I'm My playing on hard? Again. Why is it your turn again? I get to take those rocks. Why? Why does he get to take those rocks? I have a feeling he's literally just making up the rules as he goes to benefit him. You get another turn. Yes, I do. My turn again. Okay, this is very weird. All, literally, the only thing he told me to how to play the game is just try to get as many rocks as you can. If the last one is an empty space on your side, you capture the whole column. That's interesting. You get another turn. Okay. Okay, so none of those are empty spaces. So how about we prep the rocks? I get to go again. Congratulations. My turn again. So if that moves one, does that mean he gets that rock as well? Well, now I guess I get that rock. Okay. 
Very weird. Right on. You get another turn. Yes, indeed. Um. Okay. So if we have four here, we could have five. One, two. I'd like to get a bunch of rocks to capture all of those, but I don't think that's going to happen. This is weird. Again, very much wish that they explained the rules before throwing you right into it. That'd be kind of nice. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I would get another turn if I do that. Let's do it. You get another turn. Let's do it. You go. Burp, burp, burp. You go. Yeah, I do go again. You go again. Okay, so this should allow me to capture his rocks. Those rocks are all yours now. Yes, that's how we do it. Unfortunately, I couldn't double up and get both sets of the rocks. Okay, but I don't want him to get mine, so... I guess I'll move him over one, and maybe I can capture his rock on my turn. Probably not. He's probably going to move turn that again. one. Yeah, darn. If he'd moved the other one, I might have had a shot. <sighs> that's that's a shame. Okay, so so at this point, Carrot's already won. So there's not really any point in continuing. Okay, that was an interesting one. Uh, let's go concentrate? I like the Pajama Sam card faces. We're going hard uh, again. There we go. Is this like, oh, is this going to be like Remember? Like a match memory game? Hello, I'm Florette. Oh, hey, Florette! Time once again for... Concentrate! We take turns flipping tiles until there's a match. Player with the most tiles at the end of the game wins. Okay. Alrighty, let's play! Alright, let's, as... let's see if I'm as good at memories. As this... Oh, man, Zucchini Man! And Kane. It's my turn. Okay, she's already Your pretty turn. bad at this. Yeah! Found a match. Yeah, I nice did. Nice job. Then we have Carrot, and we got the Remember toaster. That you need to find two pictures that are the same. Yes, I'm That's aware. Please turn. don't tell me the rules every single time. Oh, there's Carrot. You? Yeah, I did get a match. Oh, Snowflake Inspector. Nikki Holidays. Nice. <laughs> Nikki Holidays. Oh, okay, Those she got that one. Match. Yes, I I'm aware. Wonder. Oh, she's she's messing me up by doing it in a weird order. Darkness! Oh man, we gotta get darkness. Those tiles don't seem to go together. Oh, the baguette and the donut. Okay, please stop saying they don't do or don't match every time. Okay, she got Those lightning. You already knew that Those was the zucchini. Seem to go together. Yep. The baguette is mine! Oh, I forgot about the weird candle. Oh, oh! Wait, no! Shoot, that was a different candle. What the heck is that?! Oh man! Oh, it's the planks! I forgot about the stream beam guy over there. Ooh, wait! Where was the celery? Yes. Those two. And this is the highest difficulty. Yeah, we got him. Oh, the plums. Those tiles the plumers. Hmm. Okay. Okay. You fail. Otto. Otto was up here. No, that was the toaster. No, dang it. No, Otto was, I think, over here. Yeah, there's Otto. Ooh, the Velocimometer, eh? Nope, that's Florette. Okay, she, she found the egg guy who likes french fries. Good job, Florette. 
Let's see who you do better than that, though. Okay, oh wait. There he is! The inspector detector. Oh, the lollipop man! No, oh, that was the other candle. Shoot. Luke Wigglebig and Chuck Cheddar. Oh, the plums! Uh, they were... No. Oh. How many candles are there? No, oh, they were my plums! Yeah, good job, Florette. It was fantastic. Oh! Okay, good. Grandma candle is mine. Oh, who's this? Where's the celery at? No, that's General Beetroot. Darn it! Oh wait. Okay, the vacuum's over there. Florette is up Another there. Match. Nice. Nice job. Thank you. Donut. Okay, the donut was um down here. Yes. Another. Okay, weird... Another oh my gosh, the weird can... The sunscreen cans were next to each other. That's funny. Chuck Cheddar, he was over here. Another okay. The boards were, uh, I think, over here. Yes! The toaster was up here. Oh, that candle was over here, Another right? Match. Yes! You go again. Oh, great. Restream chat just logged out on me. But I'm on a roll. Come on! Oh no, it's one of those things where I literally will have to close out of the stream to get chat back up and running? Are you serious? You're not serious, are you? That is not incorrect. That is literally my email and password. Oh, screw off, Restream. You're the worst. No one's saying anything anyways. Yeah, that's true. I, oh, wait. I, that's weird. I can see the chat through OBS, but not through... Yeah, whatever. We'll just keep going. Uh, okay. Darkness. Darkness was up there. General Beatroot was down there. Uh, Velocimometer was here. No, that was a little, little big. No, I think she's adjacent to it herself. Yeah. No, she was right next to herself. Okay, so she probably cleans up the rest, right? Never mind. And the last match was the celery. We have matched up all the. Oh man, I destroyed Florette there. You won. Yeah, I did. My first win. <laughs> what would you say to another round? I'd say. see you later. I'd say no. I'm quitting while I'm ahead. Okay. Uh, happy fun squares. How could this be anything but happy and fun? Hard. Let's go. Oh wait, is this lines and boxes? <gasps> Hello. Darkness. Darkness. There's no better way to pass the time than to play happy fun squares. The object of the game is to fill the grid with as many boxes as possible until the player with the most boxes wins. You can <gasps> go first. I am so happy Darkness is back! <laughs> okay, th this is literally just lines and boxes. Oh my gosh, he put on sunglasses. He's so cool. <laughs> okay, well, I'm not gonna finish any squares. <laughs> it's up to you, Darkness. I wonder where I should move next. I just what I don't know. I love Darkness. He's one of my favorite characters. He's such a fun guy. <laughs> the strategy here is literally just don't complete any squares. And don't let your opponent complete any squares. So if we do this, he cannot complete any more squares. Oh, very good, Darkness. Very good. Boxed in. You're boxed in! <laughs> well, it, do it does happen sometimes. Way to think out of the box. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Darkness. I'm feeling boxed in. <laughs> I'm so glad Darkness gets to play fun games again. 
Way to think out of the box. Oh, he's just gonna make the same box puns over and over again, isn't he? Alright, darkness, I see how it is. I'm feeling boxed in. It's going to end with one person getting, like, all of the boxes, isn't it? Hello, I'm Darkness. Yes, and it's it's so fantastic to get to play games with you, Darkness. This game's a little boring, I gotta admit. They said this was super happy, fun boxes. And I'll, I'll be honest, the, the title was maybe a wee bit misleading. <laughs> it's just gonna be the same thing over and over again. You like this game, Darkness? <laughs> I mean, he Darkness is just absolutely ecstatic that he has someone to play with. So, it's understandable. Oh my gosh, <laughs> this game's gonna go on forever. That's about the size of it. What a waste of rope. I'm feeling boxed in. It's so fantastic. It is literally... It's literally going to amount to who happens to get the first square, pretty much. I don't think there's any actual strategy involved with this game. Oh wait, no wait, nope. Never mind. <laughs> I was wrong. I wonder where I should move next. I don't know, darkness. This. It would have been nice if Darkness had more dialogue. I guess the super fun part of this game is that you get to play play against Darkness. And you know what? I'll I'll hap I'm happy to oblige. Yeah, Darkness. I'll just take the easy moves. <laughs> Oh no! I missed that! Oh, he tricked me! What should I do? Uh oh. Darkness may have won just because I missed that. <laughs> I was on autopilot. I wasn't even paying attention to what he was doing. Oh no. That's so many. I wonder where I should move next. Oh shut up, Darkness! <laughs> Okay. We at least get two. Stupendous. Stupendous. Yeah, sh shut up, Darkness. 
Ah, uh, that was so sneaky of him. He's like, I, I see he's on autopilot. <laughs> I could do a sneaky. <laughs> But that means his AI is not perfect. Because that could have backfired on him. If I was paying attention, I would have, could have been the one to get all of those. So he might... So now I have to... I really do have to pay attention to what he does from now on. Because from now on, if he ever happens to make another slip-up, I've, I've got to capitalize on it right away. Because the next, the next mistake he makes could be even bigger. Okay, nothing new there. Alright, darkness. <laughs> You won't blind me to the truth anymore. Get it. Yeah, game's, game starts heating up uh, later on. Uh, yeah, I can do that. Aha! You made us. I did. It's still you. I know it's still my move. Okay, I think. Okay. So he gave us four more squares, which is yeah, that's pretty generous of him. Thank you, Darkness. I'm very appreciative. Oh yeah, he's slipping now. Lovely. Uh, no more squares from that, I don't think. Alright. Now is where we really start having a limit on what moves we can play. Oh. Oh, darkness. That was not a good move. I'm getting a bunch of stars for that. I'm catching up. Bad move, darkness. Bad move. Uh, yeah, here we go. Way to think out of the box. Are there any valid moves? Yeah, I can do that. Alright. Good move, darkness. Because that only gives me three squares. Hmm. So are there any moves I can do where, uh, uh -huh, or that would give him... Would that only give him one free square, though? Yeah, I think that only gives him one free square. Uh, I didn't see where his last move was. Oh, great. Do I have to now squint really hard and try to... Where did he draw the line? I had to look away to see chat. And he's like, ooh, I'm gonna make a sneaky move he won't be able to see. Where did it, where is it? Oh my gosh. Darkness, what did you do? Where did you move?
playing right of his block would only give him one. That's true. Yeah, I'll just do that. Oh, that's where it was, you little sneak! I didn't see that! Ah, oh, no, I think Darkness won because of that. What do you mean? You're oh, no, he's taking all of this! Well, until he, until he reaches here. Okay. Okay, okay. It's not as big a deal as I thought. Okay. Now, where could I move that would give him the fewest in a row? There's this chain here, there's this chain here. That's only six. That's not a huge deal. Same with this one. Uh, we don't want to have a really long chain in a row, so yeah. Here, we'll give him the six. Let's see. I don't know where to go. <laughs> oh, that's... Thank you. That was pretty nice. Alright, and now I guess I'll give him the next group of six, probably? Yeah, I think that's the way to go. All the others will give way more. Darkness. Oh, wait. No. Okay, I'm like, <laughs> he definitely... Okay, thanks for giving me this giant trade of him. I think Darkness just handed me the win right there. He gave me, like, the longest chain. Or at least one of them. That was a... That literally just gave me a huge amount of them. Oh, except this little four here. Okay, tell you what, Darkness, you can have the four. <laughs> There's my consolation prize! <laughs> I feel like the board could have maybe been a little smaller. I don't think it was necessary to make it this big. Did he just give me the next biggest chain? Nice to know that even on hard difficulty, the AI is far from perfect. No! It didn't register my click! That's not fair! I clicked up here and it registered as me clicking down there. <laughs> I mean, I don't think that's gonna cost me the game, but... I meant to click up there, and it did not register. <laughs> that's okay. Actually, that might have worked out, because now I get this long chain. Takes darkness. Actually, if, if I draw something here and interrupt it, so that'll give him four, which is a lower amount than he'd get if I had to give him some of these. Similarly up here, like I don't wanna here. You can have the three here. <laughs> and then I get the longer chain. Okay, so there's a little bit of strategy here, but not a lot. Checkmate darkness. You won! No! That took forever! <laughs> I'm not doing that again! Wow. Uh, okay, I just want to see what the heck do they mean by puzzle games. So, oh, there's Jigsaw Puzzle and Slider Puzzles. Okay. Okay. <laughs> How many puzzle pieces is that going to be? Why does Pajama Sam have Jigsaw Puzzles of himself in his house? This seems a little strange. 
Okay. Okay, so that's actually- Oh, alright, right. Oh, okay. So this actually is a lot of jigsaw pieces. Interesting. Okay, I like this. I like jigsaw puzzles. They are underrated. Uh, boop, boop, boop. Hmm. That piece doesn't seem to fit. Well, we'll get. Hmm. That piece doesn't seem to fit. Well, we'll get there eventually, Sam. Uh, where are the bonbon pieces? Yeah, you don't need to tell me whether the piece fits or not. I'll figure it out on my own, Good Sam. Knew that piece would fit. Yeah, well, it is your jigsaw puzzle after all. Wow, that piece fits. Where's the other corner piece? That's what was throwing me off. There, finally, there's the corner piece. Just, Sam, you normally don't put all the jigsaw pieces, like, on top of one another. Usually not how it's done. Okay, I like the jigsaw puzzles. That's always fun. I still think it's a little strange that Pajama Sam has a jigsaw puzzle of himself. Just a little odd. Good job. I don't think that yeah, everyone freaks out. Oh my gosh, it's the muffins florette. Oh, these are just screenshots from Pajama Sam 3. Oh, we should have done that one. <laughs> That's a good one. Oh, there's a lot. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no, we should have done that one. Oh, man. That would have been a much better puzzle. Oh, well. What you gonna do? Oh, my gosh. How many of these are there? There's so many. Yeah, so all of these are just screenshots, more or less. From the Pajama Sam games. Oh, that's another great one. Pajama Man! <laughs> Do we have Lightning Strip to Cleveland as one of them? Please. Please give me Lightning Strip to Cleveland. Tell it. No. Okay. That would be. That would's a little too much to ask for. What is the slider puzzle? Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, I know how sliders work. Okay. Oh, wait. Okay, now we can do darkness. Or pajama man. No, we're gonna find darkness. Yes. Shuffle. Oh boy. Ew. Ew. This is gonna be so hard. Oh no, I'm already regretting doing this. No, no, never mind. Never mind. Nope. That's gonna take way, way too long. It took it. It takes me hard. It takes me long enough doing a four by three slider puzzle, let alone that. Oh no way. Uh uh. No chance. I'm doing that. And well, you know. Okay. Okay. This is gonna be exactly the same as it is in Pajama Sam One, right? It's just tic tac toe, right? Welcome to Cheese and Crackers. Glad you could make it. You know, this game reminds me of Tic Tac Toe. It's because it's literally the exact same game. Be the cheese, and I'll be the crackers. Okay. Try to get three of your pieces in a row. I guess I'll go first. Do it. Okay, he goes in the corner. 
what should I? Well, whoever goes first in tic tac toe just like either guarantees wins or like is very close to getting a guaranteed win. Oh wait. Let's see. Okay, darkness is very stupid. Granted, this is easy mode. You got three in a row. Okay. Wow. Well, of course. No, I don't want to play again. Okay. No, tic tac toe. No, thank you. Uh, what the heck is jumping beans? Choose your game option. Hard. Let's try hard. Are you ready to play jumping beans? The object of the game is to get as many of your opponent's pieces as possible. Jump over your opponent's piece when there's a free space on the other side. Once you've reached the other side of the board, you can this is literally just checkers. and move out freely. Let's play, shall we? See you nope, later. that's literally just checkers. Well, Alright, fans and teleporters, is this on-ramps and off-ramps? Game options for fans and teleporters. Hard. Oh, no, it shoots in... Well, I guess on-ramps and off-ramps is shoots and ladders. Fans and teleporters! One of my all-time favorites! Okay, Pajama Sam, I'm going to introduce you to some better games, like Dominion. Before your opponent. And remember, on this level, the teleporters, fans, and tubes are all activated. You go first. Okay. Three. Cool. Now we get free pieces. Okay. Way to go! Okay, so the fans are the ladders, the tubes are the sh are the chutes, and then the teleporters work both ways. All right. Oh boy, we can get another fan. Another fan. Sounds great. RNG based, but you do get to choose which of your pieces get it does the movement. So there's at least a tiny bit of strategy. This is Pajama Sam on the hardest difficulty. So, for example, I'm not taking the teleporter back down. I'll use mo I'll move a new piece to hit this fan. Wow, Pajama Sam's a very good sport. Okay, I'm so this spinner is definitely rigged. Wait, why did my guy... Oh, he pushed my guy forward into the teleport? Wait. Oh, it teleports you back to start? Oh. Alright, I'll return the favor there, Pajama Sam. This spinner's rigged. We've only ever spun three or two. Guess I'll move that guy forward a little. And, I, and that's why. All right, Pajama Shane, what do we got here? Four? Okay, well, I'm not moving on to the shoot over there. I'll move a new guy over here. I'm not going back to the... S no, I'm not going back down that shoot. No way. What? Okay, yeah. So you're... My guy... Guys will push other guys forwards if they land on the same space. Um... I don't really want to move that guy closer to the teleporter, just in case Pajama Sam rolls a 2 and decides to be a, a jerk. Oh, now if I get a 3, I'm definitely pushing him down the chute, though. 4. 4. Alright. Um... No, that'll put me on this. Okay. We'll move our guy up here. See, there, there's, some, there's some strategy here. This, this is like what chutes and ladders should be. Oh, clever, you pushed your own guy forward. Alright. <laughs> I'm not moving that, nope. Guess we're moving our final guy out. <laughs> Waiting for that three. Stop making me spin four! I don't want to spin four all the time. My other two pieces can't, don't want to go up for. There we go. Everything's going down at two. Hey! So I thought the teleporters were connected with each other. 
but they weren't. Oh, so he's returning the favor. That makes sense. That tube's not nearly as detrimental as the first one, though. Besides, we get a fun tube ride. Alright, we definitely going home. Yeah. Four. So we could send him up here, or we could push our guy up one. Yeah, let's do that and send him down the tube. <laughs> That's the way you do it. Of course, he could immediately return the favor if he gets a two. Great. Oh my gosh, <laughs> we got like four in a row, that's crazy. Well, gee, I wonder. <laughs> this reminds you of Marble Drop? Yeah, I mean, it's... it's The core gameplay here is shoots and ladders. There's just a little more intricacies to the rule. Really? You're forcing me to push his guys forward. One. Everything's going down the tubes. One. Are you kidding me? Three. All right, Sam. Time to go down the chute again. I have a feeling we're all going to get stuck here for a while. Because there's too much bad stuff all in a row. You've got to be kidding me. Well, oh wait, no. We're pushing his guy down the tube and pushing our guys forwards. Yeah, we're now just basically in a loop where we keep pushing each other down this one tube over and over again. Because we got four guys in a row and they all push each other. Yeah, see? It just keeps happening. And that's because you got to get a pretty precise roll to get out of danger here. Doggone it! Stop giving me one! I cannot believe you didn't push me down the chute. Oh, finally! Yes! We can finally go on the fan! <laughs> oh my gosh, it pushed me up so far. Well, I'm not going down the chute, so there we go. Once I get my second piece in, I'm stopping. Oh, hey. Yeah, I'll push him down the chute. Boom. I like how this is kind of a hybrid of the three different worlds from the first three Pajama Sam games. I mean, the only three Pajama Sam games. Alright, there we go. We got our second guy home. <laughs> there we go. I'm counting that as a win. Alright, so we've seen all of the games here. So this is... Okay, this was better than I was expecting it to be. This is actually pretty fun. This definitely reminds me of Pup-Pun and Fatty Bear's Activity Pack, which is another underrated game.